weekly, you know? Yeah. I was very impressed by that. God, this is such a gorgeous mod here, just like street. It's in Orban time. Sure. <laughs> Blue bionic shoulder. Alright, Ben Ruth Berry. You know it, you love it, you've seen it before. Ben has the home advantage with the Xenoblade mod. True. We do be Xenoblading. Good day for a well battle. Now go! At most, three more sets of the night, yeah. So, big combo from Barry. Try to finish off with an up smash. Maybe get some extra percent on before the kill dart pops, but it doesn't happen. Oh. Ben with these late nares. Oh, turn around! Down He's kill. racking on damage. Ben looks very precise today. You know, he hasn't had a lot of mistakes. Like, his, he's incredibly careful, incredibly well. Yeah, his hand skill looks fair today. That's good. It's fun. I, I think that's one of the most frustrating things is when you feel like your your hand skill is what's holding you back. So watching him execute so well is insane. But also, Barry's that guy. Yeah. Um, wow, that was insane from Barry. I didn't, didn't hit him for so long. Yeah, Barry... Wow. There were so many just raw call-outs from Barry in that stock, and he made that stock look very, very dominant. Ooh. Ooh. Ben tries to get the early kill with Smash, but then he gets the F Smash anyway. If he was still in red, that would kill for sure. He could kill here, though. Yeah, flip kick's too good, dude. You gotta respect the first time. Yeah, he didn't recognize the bear was trying to go hot. Wow, he waited so long to mare there. Ran up, sat there in a bear, and Barry still just sat there and shield. I remember saying this earlier during the other side. I think Ben Zach's out of patience probably just start calling you shielding out with congrats because he's not respect for he's not He's letting himself get shield camp too much. Yeah, he's not doing anything off of the shield. It's like he's Barry Barry's not pressing the button after getting Tomahawk. Like we saw it every time, Barry's just not pressing a button. I think he's going to just sit there and take your grab. Well, obviously, I'm not the one in Loser's Finals. So. Of course. But he is putting in all the effort to get the Tomahawk and not really getting the mileage out of it by grabbing. Yeah, that was some good spacing. Another up smash. Barry just knows you want to jump there. I mean, you're short. What are you going to do? You How often do you see Barry miss an up smash? Not very often. Barry. And that's good because. Brawler smash attacks are very middle. Very strong, but holy shit. So wow. much in leg. Doesn't matter if you kill your opponent from it though. Nope, Ben Star KO. Barry finds his kills. It's gonna be interesting seeing how Ben keeps away from these up matches in the next game. Hell, even in this game. Out of yeah, it's not game, over yet. Yeah, Attic Shield game has been so strong so far. Oh, that might be the game. Oh, he drops I, it. I think he pressed. The A button too early. That could have been game, honestly. That F smash probably does a lot of work. It's very scary to see Ben in the corner against Barry. Yeah, you can't do much to show that my dad. That's Whoa. the game. Hey, fast games, I'm cool with that. That was crazy though. We love fast games. We do. 1-0 Barry so far. I mean, this is how the last one started. We start off with the quickest game we'd seen almost all night. Into a close game, into Ben fighting a really good set. So yeah. maybe we'll see that again. Phoenix does make a good point in chat. This mod in PS2 looks great. I love it. Yeah, uh, the mods on the Switch go hard. Um, wow. I'm, I'm almost uh, like, good. Yeah, go hard. I'm pretty sure Ben made this too, so shout out to him for that. Super well made. <laughs> the microspace and the death attack. Got all this. Oh. Ooh! Yeah, buffer deactivation. Shield cancel. Yeah, I love buffer deactivation. It's so cool. Air slash is so good. And that's gonna be the next step calling out these overshoots. Wow. You can just dash back air slash. Dude. Oh! Yeah, I noticed he's holding forward a lot. That was some cool movement. When in the last set, I feel like he got most of his mileage from waiting for Barry to come in and punishing him for it. Yeah, and you'll remember like game five towards the end of it, he started calling out the overshoot by just like... Ooh, what a nice catch. Yeah, he does get the option of standing his ground to hit Barry almost for free if he does do the running away yeah. whip punishing. Like that's exactly what happened is the first set, Ben spent the whole thing just dashing back. 
so that at the end of game five, when he really needed it, he could just stuff out. Oh my god, yeah. Wow, that completely didn't even trade beat backslash. Yep, that move has no verbal disjoint, and he loses the stock for it. This is what happens when people know how to cover backslash. Um, of course, I go into it. Oh, yeah. But Ben spent the whole game dashing back to make Barry overshoot and then start stuffing him out for approaching because he has to wait to swing. But he hasn't conditioned him yet this set, so he's just kind of getting caught out for trying to swing early. Ooh. Good backslash. Pop over shot butt, get yourself in. Oh, air slash isn't kill yet. Harry keeps holding on to this stop. Ben just can't take it, he's got 180. Let's go Nair. I don't even think he <laughs> needed Smash Mallow to kill with that. Probably not, but you'd rather be safe and, sorry. safe and sorry. For sure. Good shield for Ben. Barry putting out a lot of good pressure. I'm, I'm really impressed with how Barry turned it up to this game. Yeah. Barry lived for so long last talk because he was so careful. And the game is still almost even. As I'm saying that, Ben is losing it. Yeah, I mean, it looks like that last game too. Barry kept his first stock for a long time. He earned a lot of extra credit. Could be on Ben to figure out how to take the stock a little earlier and maybe not get steamrolled by percent additions. Ooh, Ben didn't have a jump. He made it back. Barry's looking for the up smash. No punish on up smash? I feel like Ben misses a lot of punishes on laggy moves when he's trying to be super careful. I think he's just... Yeah, you're probably right. He's probably just trying not to get killed for it. And he's expecting maybe too much. That DI was scary, but... That up smash was scarier. And he's just calling out the landings. Ben's swinging and he's still getting hit for them. This is absurd. The priority on Brawler's up smash is unprecedented. That's what I'm talking about. Barry keeps his stocks for so long, and now Ben's trying to just take a stock. He keeps getting extra credit piled on. Yeah, he has to play catch up, but it's not working out for him. Wow. He can't figure out how to take this lead back. Good dash back. If that forced attack off five, that probably could have been a smash up to it. Oh, but there's a smash there. Yeah, good run up. Um, and that's what I'm saying. He needs to take these stocks a little earlier. Dude. Very late on the reaction to the directional air dodge. That was a scary reaction for both players. I think something that Barry does really well, almost better than any player I've seen with the exception of Jazz, is not letting Ben set up landing mixes. Barry just moves away, and all of a sudden you're swinging into empty space and getting f smash. Uh, like, Ben tried to set up that up air on flat there and just didn't get to because Barry left. And that back air takes it! That's the second game of the set. Wow. Things are flying by. Barry's playing hot. We may see a reset if he makes it to Chaz. But this is what we saw last time. Ben lost two quick games and all of a sudden... It's time to adapt. We'll see if he has the sauce. I think he definitely does. He just has to... Think carefully, play safer, and not miss his punishes. I'd almost say he doesn't need to play safer, he needs to play more Good day for well, fully. Like, he's losing a lot go. of big punishes. He'll find his time though. Wow. Shilmanado just has a tendency to make moves negative. Yep. Yellow art does funny things. So Oof! He almost catches that big read. That's the second or third time I've seen Ben go for Nair Dare today. I think it's a good idea, but if it whips, you're losing a good string, so. Is that two frame? I think it does. Wow. Oh, catches the no jump. jump. Tries to catch him going low, but he aired on his perfectly. Uh, ben just, he's having a hard time finding his early stocks, and Barry keeps killing him at a consistently low percent. I feel it's because Barry is so good in disadvantage, he doesn't get scared, and he really knows how to mix it up. I mean, ben just did not flinch there, he just held children not to choose to play Barry's game, which is probably the right decision. We saw them running back in tandem, but Ben keeps wanting to hold forward. Yeah, that was a good backslash, but Barry's watching for it and calls it out. 
Wow, so much empty movement from Ben. It looks like he is making the adaptation. This game is super close. If he can end this stock, I think this game is set up for Ben to win. Maybe. Barry's been very clinical with his recovery today. I I don't see Barry getting put into bad situations with recovery. Like, he's making it on stage. He's skipping ledge almost entirely most of the time. He does not have to interact with a lot of these strong ledge trapping characters. I think he's so good at making it, like, over his ledge. As I say that, though... Ooh. All right, extra credit for Ben. Let's see what he can get. It looks like he's getting a ton off of it. Yeah, a single buster art, and he's already put on... Almost 70%. Almost a stock. That would have been up air, up air for sure. Oh. Ooh, that would have been a good hit. Larry's stock almost ends anyway. Yeah, that shock button saved him. Larry's so good at just keeping Shulk away after that stock reset. That's how you know if someone understands the characters. How well they can play away from stock reset. What are they fishing for? What do they need? Yeah. I feel like both these players know the mental game of it so well. Absolutely. <laughs> the jab. <laughs> ben looking to be a bit of a mash or classic Oklahoma player. Oh no, this is some high level mashing. It is. With the jabs and down tilts backwards. A lot and of movement. Holy shit, I feel smash. like the F smash should have hit. Ooh, up, up, or smash right there, that's a kill. Very, ooh, I feel like Ben might have been able to snatch a kill there, but it would have been risky. Definitely, I don't think I would have gone for it. He hesitates too much on the grab, and he, he dies! He doesn't pull the trigger on that dash attack, and he loses his stock for it. Ben's having a lot of trouble committing to things this set. Oh my god! Yep, yeah, Barry drags him off stage with it. That's... That's the spinning axe kick. It's so good. And that's the set. Story. Yeah, wow, that was a fast set. Very I feel easy. like we might have cursed the rest of Bracket. We said we wanted fast 3-0s. And boy.